How you doing divers? In this video, I'm going to show you how to install your ROV's internal electronics. Let's get started. Take the rear dome's built-in Ethernet connection and plug it into the Ethernet port on the Raspberry Pi. Then, place the internal assembly face down in front of the mounted rear dome between the left and right rails. On your right side motor driver, you'll see two slots marked M2B and M2A. Take the internal motor leads for the horizontal uh, right side thruster and slide them into those slots. Then, use a screwdriver to tighten down those set screws to fasten the wires into place. And one thing that's worth noting is the polarity of each wire. Negative wires go into the B slots and positive wires go into the A slots. And now we can connect the internal leads for the right vertical thruster to the remaining slots in the motor driver. And once again, use a screwdriver to fasten those wires into place. Now we can follow a similar procedure to connect the left side motor's leads. Go ahead and slide the left horizontal motor leads into the M1A and M1B slots. Then with a the screwdriver, fasten them into place with the set screws. Next, slide the left vertical motor leads into the remaining two slots. With a screwdriver, fasten those set screws into place. And just as before, the negative wires go into the B slots and positives go into the A slots. To finish installing the internal electronics assembly, tilt the whole assembly backwards into the dome. Take some time to rearrange the wires uh, and, and re keep rearranging them until it rests flush against the inside of the rear dome. Now take a desiccant packet and place it inside the rear dome. I like to keep mine behind the internal electronics assembly. This will make sure your dome doesn't fog up while you're diving. With your electronics installed, your ROV should now look something like this. Thanks for watching.